Hi friends, our today's topic is partnership lesson 2 and in this video we are going to learn some of the very important question which frequently appears in our exam. So let's try to understand the concept and try to solve the question. So A joined a business by investing 4500 rupees, right? So investment of A was how much? 4500 rupees, right? And A is starting the business. So for how many months A will invest? A will invest for 12 months, right? and was joined by B afterwards with 5400 rupees. So after some months it was joined by B and B investment was 5400. And for how many months B invested that we don't know. So suppose it was nothing but X a month, right? Okay. If the profit at the end of the year was divided in the ratio 2 is to 1. So profit of A is to profit of B is equal to nothing but 2 is to 1. So B joined after how many months, right? Okay. So we know investment into time, again investment into time will be nothing but profit, right? Okay. So what is investment of A? 4500. And for how many months B invested? 12 months. What is investment of B? 5400. For how many months B invested? X month. And profit ratio is 2 is to 1, right? See 20 will cancel 20, 9 5 9 6 and 6 2 times. So it will become 10 divided by x is equals to 2 by 1. So 2 will again divide this by 5 times. So x will become 5. That means B invested amount for how many months? B invested amount for 5 months, right? That means after how many months B joined? So B would have joined after 7 months, right? B would have joined after January, Feb, March, April, May, June and July. So B would have joined after how many months? 7 months and that, that is the only reason B invested only for 5 months and A joined in the beginning only. So A invested for how many months? For 12. Question number 2. A began a business with RS 85,000 rupees, right? So what was the investment of A? 85,000 rupees, right? He was joined afterwards by B with 42,500 rupees, right? So A invested in the beginning. So what will be the time? So A will invest for 12 months, right? And for how much period does B join? So for how much period does B join? So that period we do not know and that only we have to calculate. So we'll suppose X month. If the profit at the end of the year was divided in the ratio 3 is to 1. So this is also the similar question as question number 1. So again we can write investment into time is to investment into time will be nothing but profit ratio. Right. So what is the investment of a 85,000 into what is the time of a 12 then again 42,500 into the time you have to calculate and profit is equal to 3 is to 1. Right? Now we can write it like this into 12 divided by into x is equal to 3 by 1. So this will divide this by 2 times and 3 will divide 12 by 4 times. So x will become 8. Right? The That means b invested the amount for how many months for eight months so my answer will become d eight months see here in the same question two things they can ask after how many months b joined after how many months b joined so see b invested the amount for eight months that means definitely B would have joined after four months and that was the only reason he was not able to invest the money for much time, right? So B after four months is have joined, then only he can invest for eight months, right? So B invested after how many months? Four months. And if they will ask for how much period the B does join. So B join only for eight months. So our answer will become D. See in the question, both the options will be there. So you have to be very careful. Otherwise, we will end up in doing the mistakes. Thanks for watching the video.